This will sound very strange, but the death of Alex Trebek, the host of the show Jeopardy, on the 8th of November in 2020, at the age of 80 years old, after having hosted 8,000 episodes, is a prophecy that is predicting that Kamala Harris will die in a plane crash that will be caused due to a bird strike in St. Louis on precisely December 26th, 2022. The date that this video is posted proves that this prediction was made ahead of time, as does this time-stamped email and Forensic Notes PDF. If you are skeptical, please email me and I will forward these to you. After Harris's death, she will be replaced by Michelle Obama, and soon after, Barack Obama will replace Michelle. This is the reason why Kamala Harris will die in a plane crash. It is so that Barack Obama can become the president again. It is predicted that Michelle Obama will very soon become the 47th president, and soon after that, Barack Obama will become the 48th president. In the Bible, a goat is symbolism for the Antichrist. In pop culture, goat stands for greatest of all time. Kamala Harris will die in a plane crash after her plane's engine will suffer a bird strike. As a result, the GOAT Antichrist will come to power. The GOAT of college football coaching died at the age of 61 and was born in 1961. The GOAT Antichrist was born in 1961 and will become the president again and the Antichrist at the age of 61. Coach Mike Leach won 84 games with the Texas Tech Raiders, and this year when he died at the age of 61, his team had a record of 8-4. and four. The GOAT Antichrist was born on the date 8-4 in 1961. In the Bible, a period of 10 days is symbolism for the period of persecution from the GOAT Antichrist in the end times. It is predicted that on December 26th, Kamala Harris will die in a plane crash due to a bird strike. And it is predicted that there will be a prophetic sign that will be related to this that will occur on December 23rd, 10 days after the GOAT of college football coaching died. Coach Mike Leach was famous for leading the FBS conference in offense in 10 of his 21 seasons as a coach. And he was famous for coaching the Texas Tech Red Raiders for 10 years. And he was famous for his revolutionary air raid style of offense. The name air raid hints at a bird strike of Kamala Harris's airplane. On the same day that coach Mike Leach died was the day that the hockey player for the Washington Capitals, player number eight, scored three goals in a game to become only the third player in history to score 800 goals in their career. The other two players to reach this milestone wore jersey number nine and jersey number 99 because the number nine is the most important number in God's true big picture of signs, patterns, and connections, as from the Bible, it symbolizes God's judgment. And God was pointing to this judgment, and he was pointing to these two players that wore jersey nine and 99 through this player's 800th goal on this day. This player was awarded the MVP honor when the Washington Capitals won the Stanley Cup in their 44th season, which hinted at the 44th president in the nation's capital in Washington. His three goals on December 13th were in Chicago, the hometown of the 44th president. His jersey number eight and 800 goals was to confirm that the event that is described in Revelation chapter 8, a catastrophic solar flare, coronal mass ejection from the sun, hit of the earth, will occur exactly 400 days after this on January 17th, 2024. But this will be explained in another video. This player scored three goals to make him the third player in history to reach the career milestone, on the same day of the death of the coach who coached the Red Raiders for 10 years. 
the reason for three goals to make him the third player was to confirm that 10 days and then an additional three days from this day will be the predicted date that Kamala Harris will die in a plane crash due to a bird strike. The air raid coach died 96 days after the Queen of England died at the age of 96 as a result of Kamala Harris's death in a plane crash due to a bird strike Michelle Obama will become the Queen of America. Michelle Obama will return to the White House as a result of Harris's death in a plane crash due to a bird strike that will be 10 days after the death of the air raid coach who coached the Red Raiders for 10 years, which in turn was 97 days after she returned to the White House for the unveiling of her portrait on the date September 7th, which is 9-7 and hints at 97, because 97 is the 25th prime number and the 25th amendment will be used to make her the president, and then the 25th amendment will be used to make her husband the president again. Michelle Obama will replace the 49th U.S. vice president and then become the president as a result of the death of the 49th vice president in a plane crash caused by a bird strike, which will be 10 days after the death of the air raid coach who coached the Red Raiders for 10 years. And this was in turn exactly 49 months after her book Becoming was released because she will become the president. Michelle Obama will become the first female president and the 47th president as a result of Kamala Harris's death in a plane crash that will be 10 days after the death of the air raid coach who coached the Red Raiders for 10 years, which in turn was exactly 47 weeks after the death of Lucia Harris the queen of basketball, who was the first and only woman to be drafted by the NBA, and Michelle Obama will replace Kamala Harris, the first female vice president, and then become the first female president, the 47th president, and her husband is the basketball president. The death of the GOAT of college football coaching the air raid coach, which hints at the bird strike of Kamala Harris's airplane, died exactly 1109 weeks after the air raid on the Twin Towers and the Pentagon on 9-11 in 2001. The number 1109 hints at 110 and 9. God pairs the numbers 110 and 9 together to point to the 110 floors of the Twin Towers that collapsed and George Washington's walk down Wall Street after his first inauguration at Federal Hall and into the church that was the only building at Ground Zero to have survived the falling debris due to the uprooted sycamore tree that sheltered and protected Trinity Church. In God's judgment warning to ancient Israel in the book of the prophet Isaiah 9:11 says that the buildings have collapsed and the sycamore trees have been uprooted. In what today is known as the Miracle Chapel, George Washington consecrated the nation to God, saying that if the nation were to ever turn away from God, it would lose its divine protection and blessings. Wall Street is named after the nine-foot-high wall of security that the Dutch built to keep the British and the Indians out. And in the Bible, Joshua died at the age of 110, and he led the Hebrews around the walls of security before they collapsed in God's judgment. And Joshua and the Hebrews crossed the Jordan River into the Promised Land on the date 110 in the Hebrew calendar, which hints at the number 110. God pairs the numbers 110 and 9 together to symbolize all of this. And Joshua is a type for Jesus, and Jesus' first coming was officially on the date 110 in the Hebrew calendar. Two towers that were each 110 stories high is symbolism for Jesus' second coming. That God pairs 9 and 110 together to point to 9-11 is the reason why the iconic Air Force plane in the collapse of Afghanistan on the prophetic 20th anniversary of the collapsed 110-story buildings on 9-11 
was number 1109, which hints at 110 and 9. Barack Obama will become the president again as a result of the death of Kamala Harris in a plane crash, which is predicted to be 10 days after the death of the air raid coach, which was exactly 1109 weeks after the planes crashed into the Twin Towers on 9-11. Barack Obama will become the president again as a result of the death of Kamala Harris in a plane crash, which is predicted to be 10 days after the death of the air raid coach, which was exactly 90,011 days after the nation was born on July 4th, 1776. America will lose its independence 90,011 days after it established its independence. This video is also predicting that famous actor James Earl Jones, the voice of the Lion King and the voice of Darth Vader, will die on December 30th, 2022. This video is also predicting that there will be a catastrophic asteroid hit on Earth on September 2nd, 2023. This will be a fulfillment of what is described in the Book of Revelation in the Bible in Chapter 8. It has been known since the autumn of 2020 that she will die in a plane crash. But as can be seen here in this email, it was known since August of 2021. Some social media sites have a maximum length for videos that can be posted. And so I need to cut this video into two parts. Click on the link to watch the remainder of this video. You can also find this link in the description box below this video. Make sure you watch the remainder of this extremely important video that is posted on a different channel than the one you are watching now. The link to the rest of this video is in the description box below this video. Hopefully you at least found this introduction video to be interesting, and if so, please leave a like and upvote the video, and please consider sharing the video.